we are back at it again with Mega Man Battle Network. Let's get into it. Who's mom, by the way? Uh, you were mom. Okay. It's been a little, a little while since we've recorded, so we're gonna have to. It's been a little while. Have to remember everything that's happening. <laughs> <laughs> Lan, morning. Uh, I was Lan. Morning, mom. What's wrong? Not feeling well. No, it's just the water's off, so no breakfast. Dang. What? But I'm hungry and thirsty. Do Do you need the water? You need the faucet water. Well, there's not much your mom can do with no water. Yeah, but you could throw something in the microwave. <laughs> I guess. Hey, you better get going or you'll be late. All right, already. What about cereal? You don't you don't need tap water for cereal. Dude, I would never go to school without breakfast. I would be like, dude, school's going to wait. I have Dude, I went to, to school every day without breakfast. Are you serious? Yeah. I, I wouldn't be able to do that, dude. I, I'd be hungry like by like second period. I was miserable every day. I got like <laughs> I got like 4 hours of sleep. No breakfast. Went to school. <laughs> You're like, maybe today I'll feel better. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Sorry, hun, but we could have... But we could have shut off the water? Is this... Is it like in Japan? Like, do you absolutely need water for food? Maybe. Uh, I'm gonna jack in before we, uh, go to school. I just want to check... Just jack into the oven. I do like ovens, dude. They they do cook food. Not really. I, I don't bake at all. Do you bake? I bake. I like making cookies. I like making cake. I did not even know that. I think I I, I think I told you how but I made a peppermint cake one time. I vaguely recall that. When I was like when I like first learned how to make a cake and how easy it is. I was like, oh, you it, just like add flavor, like you just add extract of whatever flavor you want. Normally, it's vanilla. It's like, oh, like you could just get like peppermint extract, and now you got a peppermint cake. Huh? It wasn't that good. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really was, recommend peppermint cake. It was a failure. It was. It was I mean, like, we make. still ate it because it like wasn't like terrible, but mm. it would have been just better if it was just vanilla. I I could see that. Sometimes I feel like plain things are better than uh than going all out. What do you mean? Like having like oh my gosh, having like chocolate dipped with three layer chocolate and marble and all kinds of things like that. It's like sometimes just to keep it simple with cakes. Yeah. You know, yeah, I like a good simple like golden cake. Or, or, or white cake or whatever. Some basic whipped cream frosting. What's golden cake? It's like vanilla cake, basically. It's like it's like the basic cake. Hmm. Um, I don't really like chocolate cake that much. I ha I'm like, it's weird. I'm I'm like very sensitive to bitter flavors, and I don't know if most people consider chocolate cake to be bitter yeah I would, unless it's dark chocolate i don't know it's pretty much any well maybe maybe not any chocolate cake like i think like a hostess kind of oh, okay you know, chocolate snack cake those are like extra sweet mm. so i don't really taste any bitterness but normal like you know chocolate cake it's got the cocoa powder in it and i can kind of like taste the cocoa powder and it's a bit bitter to me like an all natural one you mean I, I guess like a like a proper baked chocolate cake, yeah. I keep trading. I'm trying not to trade. It's it's like yeah, I don't know I, I don't know what it is like why like I don't know I like my my palate favors towards sweet, which is why I always find it insane when people are like oh, man, I don't like the frosting on cake. It's too <laughs> sweet. I'm like what do you mean it's too sweet? <laughs> it's like the best part. Isn't that the point of cakes? Like I, but I, I used to, <laughs> I used to take, like, f a frosting container, and a spoon, and I just eat it. 
<laughs> is that edible? I, I mean, I, I, well, I wouldn't just eat, like... I wouldn't eat, like, a tub of it, just, like, straight up. I, I would get, like, a little bit on a spoon. Mm. And kind of snack on it. <laughs> but, like, just this, just a little bit on the spoon. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> this is my meal for the day. This is my nah. meal, a tub of frosting. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly didn't even know that I was like, you could do that. Yeah, and that was just like, that was a thing, I think all, like, me and my siblings, that was just like a thing that we did when we were kids. Eat frosting. Yeah, we just like, get a little container of Pillsbury, uh, frosting, get a spoon, you know, scoop some up, chill out and eat it. Do the same thing with, uh, cookie dough, we used to get these, uh, um, do they still make these? I don't know if it was Pillsbury or, I don't, I don't know what brand it was, but like, you get like a tube. Of uh, of cookie dough, like pre-made, you, you basically just like chop chop it into slices and bake it that way. Uh huh. But we would just, you know, take the the roll of cookie dough, just scoop some out and eat, and just eat it raw, which is probably not very safe. <laughs> yeah. But we I didn't think, know any better. I think cookie dough can actually like make you sick. Yeah, it's got raw egg in it. That oh, is that why? Which is safe in a lot of countries, but it's not in the U.S. Yeah, I mean, generally, you can eat raw eggs, look at Sylvester Stallone, but, uh, there is that chance you will get sick, you know? Yeah, the, the salmonella, it's, it's not good. <laughs> you can get pasteurized, it's it's possible that they use pasteurized eggs since it was, it was a commercial product. Yeah. I wouldn't doubt that being commercial, it's all artificial, mostly. Yeah, I've considered getting, um, you can get pasteurized egg in the shell, which is super weird to me, but you can do it. I was, I was thinking about getting some, just to make cookie dough, and just to just make ed edible cookie dough. It, it'd, it'd be a nostalgic flavor for me. <laughs> is that natural? To get it pasteurized like you said it in the shell? No, I... What the, what do they- I don't know what they do. They, like, take the raw eggs and they, like, heat it to a specific temperature so it doesn't cook, but it kills the bacteria. Interesting. I had yeah. no idea of these secret techniques. Yeah, science, man. <laughs> science, <laughs> man. Oh, come on, I'm just trying to find a virus. Did Mega Man ever have a science, man? Uh, not no. There's really no science man. Man, they they should have a, a science man, and he uh he pasteurizes eggs <laughs> online <laughs> to make they, cookie dough. They refuse to make such a powerful navy. What one thing I want to say a little bit off topic. Not that we're really on topic. Are we really on topic? Or there, or there is a topic, but uh. I mentioned it in another playthrough, which hasn't come out yet, but, um... It's really hard, obviously, since I'm taking the lead. It is really hard to game and talk and think at the same time. <laughs> like, I used to think, like, oh my gosh, you know, these these content creators, like, they're so dumb. How do they not just, <laughs> like, function while playing games? And it's just like, once you do it yourself, you kind of realize, wow. It's actually a lot harder than, you know, people make it look, so... Just, you might be a good player, you might be good at video games, but it's like another thing entirely to be good and be a content creator, like, simultaneously at the same time, like, that's... Yeah, you're, like, using the same parts of the brain at the same time, and kind yeah, of, like, it, working overtime. It really is tough, like... Like, uh, yeah, it's, it's no joke, it's no joke. And I used to, uh... I used to make fun of people, you know, it's just like, man, you suck at the game, like, why do you suck? And it's just like, no, <laughs> it, when, when you're, when you're... Why do you suck at this? It's like, well, <laughs> yeah. now we know. <laughs> now, now you, like, once you do it, once you experience it and go through it yourself, you kind of realize, like, wow, it's not the person. It's actually, like, it's pretty challenging to be good at a game and, you know, speak and record at the same time. Like, it's just... I think you get level. used to over time, you kind of learn, like, when to prioritize speaking and when to prioritize game. So that you can do both at the same time. I was gonna say, like, yeah, I, I hope I can do both at the same time, it's just... There's a whole other feat in and of itself. And, um... Gosh, I'm, I'm looking for a particular virus, but it's not here. Um... 
while we're on that note. I do that all the time when I'm on the internet. I'm looking, I'm looking at this for this virus. <laughs> I'm looking so that I can collect its goods. <laughs> <laughs> don't you guys do that when you surf the web? You're just like, oh, I gotta always find this for virus. Like Google, why don't you provide me with a better virus? <laughs> so I can collect its battleship data. <laughs> but, um... What was I gonna say? Oh. Um... I, I don't even know how to approach this subject. Uh... I was- I- I've spent the good, better part of this year researching per, on a personal level. Like, personally, not- not like anything official with hard data to back it up, but, uh... Researching... People who have collections and why they have collections and the reason for having collections and stuff like that. And... You mean, like... Collectors? Like... Yeah, like... Yeah, like collectors. And video game stuff. It, like, it could be, like, anything. Like, I've seen toy collectors, I've seen statue collectors, I've seen video game collectors, I've seen record collectors, like, manga collectors, DVD and Blu-ray collectors, uh, just, like, a whole bunch of stuff. I, I've just been, like, personally researching all this stuff, right? And, um... And, I... This, th this has nothing to do with collections, and I'm not gonna endorse or attack them, you know, uh, I'll, I'll save that for another lifetime before I speak about that but uh it w what I found interesting was I got to this uh I came across this content creator who was like a a high functioning autist and you know it's like those people like they have autism but they're like super smart to where like they they've like uh they kind of just like know like I don't know what you say, abnormal facts off the top of their heads kind of a thing, and they're really well versed in whatever they study or they do in, in their craft, basically, right? Yeah. Because it turns into like a, I, I don't even know how to explain it. like, it's just like their brain works over time on that, on whatever they obsess on kind of a thing, right? And it, uh, I came across this one content creator who, like I said, he was a high function autist and he, uh, he was a manga collector. And w one thing I thought was interesting is he talked about how whenever, like, for normal content creators, which I'm, I'm really glad that's why we're a duo, like, you and me, Sage, because, uh... He was talking about how it's very jarring and slight... You, you slightly feel insane in a way when you're, like, a single content creator and you're behind a camera. And he talked about how, like, as soon as you turn on that camera and you start talking to it and you're staring into it, you instantly drop, like, 10 IQ points in whatever you're doing, whatever you're talking about, and whatever you're, like, just whatever content you're creating or in general, too. It's just, like, you just, you, you drop IQ. And I, I thought about that for, for a while because it's kind of interesting because if you've ever watched any content creator, you notice that as they're going through whatever topic or whatever issue or whatever, you know, subject they're discussing in their video, they always do make simple mistakes, whether it be like a verbal cue, a visual cue, or... Yeah, sometimes, like, yeah, you're watching a video, and you're like, how did they make that mistake? That's so stupid. Yeah, and, it's like... Uh, like I guess, yeah, part of it, too, is, like, uh, there's so many steps, there's so many things that can go wrong. Mm -hmm. That it's kind of astounding how well <laughs> normal content creation is. Yeah. And it's like the guy was saying too, it was like it, it, was, it could be something as simple as you said the wrong word on accident, not even because, you know, you meant to say that word or whatever. It's just something in your brain kind of confused it and, you know, the wrong word came out. The wrong action came out. The wrong this or that. So I really thought it was interesting because, like you said, it, it is... He explained it as like it is kind of insane to just sit in a room by yourself, look at a camera, start talking and stuff. It's like you literally do drop 10 IQ points just because it's such a weird and bizarre concept that humans really aren't used to. Yeah, I've heard similar things too. Like if you're trying to work on something and you get a text mm -hmm. and you just try to keep focusing on what you're doing, like that, that simple notification can drop your IQ by 10 points. Really? That I didn't know. That's like crazy. You're just, you're just distracted and you can't focus. You're like, you know it's there. Mm hmm Yeah. Um, yeah, it's funny that you brought up us being a duo because, uh... When, when I originally wanted to start a Let's Play channel, I tried doing it by myself. 
I, uh, I remember booting up Ocarina of Time. It's like, I know that game inside and out, and I'm like, I'm gonna talk about <laughs> Ocarina of Time. And I started playing the game. I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh... I was like, Suko, <laughs> come on to the show with me. <laughs> I need somebody to talk to. I can't do it alone. Yeah. And because of that, we don't drop 10 IQ, we each only drop 5. Yeah, 5 each. <laughs> it's 5 each <laughs> instead of 10 total. Because, yeah, because like it's less awkward for us. Even though you don't see it as awkward, like you don't realize sitting in front of a camera, again, in a room by yourself is awkward. And, like, the awkwardness is there, but you don't acknowledge it or you don't even realize it's there. But it's it's different for us because we're also able to, like, bounce off each other, talk to each other, interact with each other. Whereas someone who's solo doesn't have that option. This is like you're talking to yourself with your own thoughts out loud. Yeah, I'm, like, a, a lot of old school Let's Players were just just uh, a, a single performance. It's like, yeah. damn. <laughs> That's impressive. This is on another level. Yeah. That is definitely mad times. Oh, it's not gonna kill him. Oh, this one. No! What'd you do? I grabbed one battle chip instead of two. I meant to grab both. Alright, well the virus isn't here, so we're gonna get back on track. That was a waste of time. Yeah, hurry, we're late! Yeah, even oh, Mega no. Man's like, what the hell are you doing? Get out of your oven! <laughs> Get out of your oven. <laughs> uh, who was male? You were. Okay. Hey, you're late! Sorry, sorry. Wow, that's one word. Dude, sorry, say sorry. sorry twice, but it's, <laughs> but it's one <laughs> word. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, was, that, was that supposed to look like that? I think that was a mistake. Oh, Lan, did you have water this morning? Oh my gosh, it's always texting. Wait, you too? Yeah, I couldn't even wash my face this morning. Yuck. You can wash it when we get to school. I hope so. Dude, I would not- Dude, I don't even- I never went in the bathroom at my school because it was all full of, like, trash, debris, and graffiti. What, uh... I would never use the school bathroom. Hey, the pond! What if there's no water at school? What? The pond's drained. Oh. Oh, no! I hope not. Well, maybe it's just this neighborhood or something. Is that like algae sitting at the bottom of the pool? Or the pond? Uh, either that or moss. <laughs> Wait, that's the same thing, no? Uh, and I guess they're different. I don't know. I never thought about it. Nah, someone fact check us. I'm worried. I'm going to go check. Wait, where are you going to go check? I think they're different, because water- algae grows in water, and moss grows on land. Oh, uh, that makes sense. So thirsty. Is it, do you have vending machines? Uh, no, this is Japan. They're not known for vending machines they or anything. <laughs> they're absolutely known for vending machines. <laughs> uh, what was- what was this kid? I, I don't know, it's just bald kid. Hey, kid. I'm late again! Yeah, bald kid. Even though he's got hair on his sprite. Where's he going? Is he gonna make it? Is he going in? Wow, I didn't know he goes in. All right, let's go into the teacher's car real quick. Yep. That's I want to see if a there's normal a normal day at school. <laughs> I'm gonna jack into the teacher's car. Uh, he won't mind. Okay. Uh, steal his viruses. <laughs> I'm gonna steal the virus data in my teacher's car. He'll get so mad. I guess that's maybe a th a thing. Like, yeah, I guess you might. Like, I guess someone like. An antivirus company might want viruses to get data from. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> All right, uh, can I go this way? Oh yeah, I can. Let's talk to the teacher. What are you doing here? Get to class. Oops, getting mad makes me thirsty. Wow. Everybody's gonna dehydrate. Stay hydrated, everybody. <laughs> Stay hydrated. You'll never know when your tan will run out of water. Yeah. Uh, there's nothing like a here. giant exercise ball. A giant is it an exercise ball? A huge ball that's used on field day. It looks lonely here. Huh? I wonder is field day a Japanese thing? Mm hmm. Field day. It sounds like a thing that I've heard before. 
It's a time recorder. We don't need to use that. Nonsense, I'll be a teacher. We don't need to record time. Shouldn't go into the office unless you need to. I guess you could say that about anything. <laughs> you shouldn't do anything unless you need to. <laughs> shouldn't brush your teeth. Unless you need to. Hurry up! Okay. Wow, what are... What's wrong? Do you have a fever? Is she the nurse? Yeah. Well, you look pretty healthy to me. Wow, what a great diagnosis. Very thorough. Cool. You need to get to class. Wow, either way you lose. I can see you! Hurry up and get to class! Guys, I just don't want to go to class. What's so wrong about that? <laughs> you don't have time to be playing with first graders. <laughs> I guess Lan just does that. Alright, do you know where the toilet is? Do we know? I don't think we know where the toilet is. I've is. never seen the toilet. It's near the stairs. You can't see it from here, though. But there's no water, so you can't use it. I mean, you could use it. <laughs> you just can't flush. Yeah. Which I, I don't recommend using, guys. Don't, uh, don't use a toilet you can't flush. Good morning. Shouldn't you be in class? Is This, this is a library now, right? Yeah, this is a library. This different different person. Same sprite. S gotta save that data. Save, right. save that data. Save the data. Save okay. the data. That's, that's what Lan does. This isn't my classroom, is it? Oh, this is my classroom. Yeah, it is. Okay. These are all your friends. Alright. Oh. I'm thirsty. Should we challenge Dex to a net battle? Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, <laughs> he, he can fight I'm thirsty. Again. Let's battle. Well, that'll definitely make us less thirsty. What do you get for beating, uh... What's his name? Uh, Gutsman? He's, I thought Gutsman was his AI. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, Dex, his name is his name. Dex. Yeah, do you get anything for beating him? Uh, I should get his... Oh my gosh, I missed that. Oh... Uh, I should get his battle chip. Like, Dude! You just take it from him? Uh... I guess... Canonically, yeah, you just take it, but um... Is it like uh, a copy though? Yeah, yeah, I mean it's like... I guess it's like his copy? I don't, I don't really know how that works. Dude, you're Z-spreading this guy. Yeah, cause I got to be invisible and attack him. Uh, okay. Watch him get hit. I'm gonna watch. <laughs> He's about to yeah, learn. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, 390. That's... Oh, that's uh, his remaining HP. Oh my gosh. Dude, you're getting wrecked by Guts, he, man. He tricked me. I'll do 200 damage right you here. You tricked me, Guts, man. Oh, did I miss? I don't know did if you? I missed. I don't know how this chip works. Oh no, it, it still looks hits. looks like you're hitting him. Dang, dude. That took out, like, more than half his damage. health. <laughs> 200 HP gone, just like that. Just like that. You screwed up, Guts, man. By existing and being in this fight. Oh no, I missed. That's a miss. I'm running out of battle chips. You would think Fireman would see ahead of time that he's gonna hit nothing. <laughs> and just be like, well... And then just go away. Or move. He, he just doesn't care. Come on, hit! Yeah. Did you right. know flame th throwers weren't like originally used as weapons. Uh, I did not know that. You can use them in like, um, you can use them to dry stuff. You can use them to like, uh, I guess like burn. I don't know, either crops or weeds or something. I don't know. Just, you use them in the agriculture. That was their original purpose. Yeah, that's why. F apparently. F Flamethrowers are legal. They're not weapons, they have other practical uses. Wow, that's insane. Oh my gosh, he went down too far. Dude, you got deleted. Okay. Wow, did he just call me kiddo? Dude, we're gonna- He did. 
All right. You're the we're, same age. We're gonna show him no mercy right now. We're gonna make him oh, cry. Man. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see how that goes. I'm gonna <laughs> call somebody kiddo. That's the same age as me. Like what the? F <laughs> <laughs> yeah. See, there's Gutsman three. Hmm. Enjoy it while you can. You're going down next time, Did land. you just destroy him in two seconds? Yeah, I used the Buster Max. Wow. Which is okay, because now we got Guts of Man 3. Dude, Guts I Man was 3. a slob! My... sack was all disorganized. I, I can't believe this, you're going to Mega Man jail. <laughs> don't tell me, uh, don't tell anyone I told you, but... A kid from B class is missing. And I smell a rat. Bing bong! I Bing bong. <laughs> I didn't know this was gonna start the story, alright. It's a secret, okay? Uh, you're the teacher. I'd like to begin homebrew. Homebrew? Teacher, we don't got no water at my house. <laughs> now be quiet. <laughs> We're going to talk about that <laughs> in homebrew. <laughs> Class? You all know that the town water has stopped. What? Miss Bari, do we know why? We're not sure, so we don't know when it'll be fixed. Really? I'm afraid we'll have to cancel class for today. Why are you afraid? You're canceling class because no water? Because no water. You can't live if there's no water. That's true. Your brain's not going to function without water. <laughs> All right. Hell yeah. Wait. <laughs> Don't walk around too much. You'll get thirsty. Okay. I'm okay now, but if we don't get water soon, I wonder what the source of the problem could be. This has got me thinking, like, what do you do when there's no water? I don't tell anyone, but I told you, but... Oh, is she gonna report that? Oh yeah, this that? is the same thing. I, I, f I think that's happened at my house at least once, where the, like, water got shut off. I gotta figure out, <laughs> figure out how to function. <laughs> I think no the craziest is when the internet goes out. Yeah, I went. I remember uh, I was without internet for like over a month one time. Dang, of, like, dude! A crazy snowstorm in the middle of October. <laughs> I think I there. I think there might be a, a name, or at least it's like documented. Like I forgot what year it was, but there was suddenly. Look, like, cause all the leaves were still on the trees. Uh. And suddenly, this huge snowstorm comes through, and uh, I, this is something I didn't realize. Apparently, the leaves come off the trees, so like when snow sits on top of the trees, it's not so much weight. Cause when the leaves are still on the trees, like all that snow is like it's, it's like holding up all the snow and all this weight. Anyway. Tons of branches and trees came down everywhere. Um, hmm. Like roads were just filled with trees. Uh, it took down all these power, like tons of power lines. The, my city was an absolute mess. And uh, we were without, without power for, I think, two weeks. Dang. Uh, yeah, it took them a while to get to us because. Uh, you know, we were just like a, a small neighborhood. They had to like, clear out trees from like all over the place just before they could even get to us and clear out the trees here. And we just had like, there was like a power line. I remember there was a power line sitting in the road and every now and then it would flare up, get super bright and make lots of noise. Uh, that wasn't scary at all. <laughs> it wasn't fear. But yeah, well, they, they eventually, yeah, after like, uh, it was like a week or two. They they finally got the power back up, uh, but still no internet. That took that took a lot longer to get back up. And uh, yeah, I, I didn't know what to do with myself. <laughs> yeah, I, I, played, I feel like some offline games. I I feel like when the internet goes out and or electricity goes out, it's kind of like life just stops. Which is yeah, I can't <laughs> I can't even remember. It must have been in. Uh, an exceptionally boring time in my life because I can't even remember like what I was doing <laughs> for all that time <laughs> without, without power. Yeah, I think you I just... played Uno like once. Uno <laughs> by yourself? 
Well, no, no, I had friends over. Oh, okay. Because they didn't have power either. They were like, well, <laughs> we gotta do <laughs> well, something. I guess it's Uno. Dude, who parks the car right here? Uh, it's a jerk. At least he's not in the road. Murph. Murph. Oh, dude, there's no water here, dude. Yeah, dude, water's gone. Was there? I don't remember what this town normally looks like, so I wouldn't have noticed. <laughs> Uh, what do we do, Mega Man? Wonder where's the water? Let's check it out. What do we check out? We check out the water plant, duh. You've got Blair, mail. You've got mail. Oh, that's yeah, right. There's a kidnapping. Yeah. Is it related to the water going out? Uh, it better be. I guess we're gonna find out in the next episode who was kidnapped why they were kidnapped, and what happened to the water. What happened to the water? The water. 